All right, let's take a look at our first clip. It comes to us. Uh, we don't know the exact location, but USA was taken in August in 1995. And apparently these rings kind of resemble um, the Olympic symbol, but uh, you know, whatever. So this footage, uh, it's not that clear. Obviously, you know, it was taken a while back, over uh, 10 years ago. But if you do take a look at it there, you know, it does look like some rings. And uh, we do have uh, three more clips of this footage. But uh, definitely, you know, something's going on over here. All right, so this is our second clip over here. Um, we slowed it down, we let it the original play. This guy's talking, obviously, as an accent, uh, possibly an Aussie, Australian. But uh, take a look at this stuff. It's going on Michigan, USA, March uh, 2015. And you can tell over here, it definitely are some rings, five rings. Not sure if this object is one or five separate things. So here's a close-up of this we're just still image. We're zooming in, and uh, you know we have two more clips to show you. So stay tuned. Okay, here is our third footage, and uh, it uh, you might have seen this in our best UFO sightings, uh, June 2016. It is apparently leaked satellite footage coming to us from 2016, and obviously in June. I mean, this is great stuff right here. I mean, it looks like uh, stealth uh, or a bomb or something like that is following it. And you can tell by the rings, it is definitely five rings. And, uh, you know, I don't know if it's a symbol or something of what's going on, but, you know, the doping scandals and all that stuff. But uh, this is some excellent footage over here. We have one more clip to show you, so stay tuned. Okay, here we go, our fourth and final clip. Wow, looks like a helicopter was leaving there at the bottom left of uh, the screen uh, behind the trees. More importantly, look at this. This is some clear footage. It's uh, five rings for sure. If you take a closer look, there's the helicopter again in slow motion. You can tell it actually might be five different objects because they seem to be separating in this particular clip as it moves so you know what uh, we're gonna have to say proof positive on this awesome footage here guys don't forget to share and like okay and you know what this is what footage is supposed to look like where you can actually see the object i mean this is 2016 after all so we'll talk to you soon all right let's take a look at our first clip it comes to us from florida usa we don't know the date but obviously it has to be old uh, anyway, look at this object. Uh, something looks like there's some kind of core, uh, and it comes down. It's kind of like a triangular, cylindrical, like a cone-shaped core. Uh, crazy footage over here, and then it also looks like it's glowing. So it's kind of hard to tell exactly what this uh, object is, but we do have a couple of more clearer clips for you. But this is definitely archive footage and uh, no idea what this is. Alright, here is our third and final clip. It comes to us from Troy, Michigan, USA. It's taken July 3rd, 2016. I mean, this is clear footage. Here is the object. Uh, it definitely looks like some kind of cone. Our cylindrical object is the core. It's, it's flashing with energy. It looks, you know, it, it looks like there's energy in two spots, but there's definitely some kind of heat distortion. Oh, this is just crazy. Look at it. And, uh, you know, I mean, there's definitely a shadow on the ground, but uh, this is, you know, I don't think it's going to get any clearer than this. So it's obviously closer than where the building is. And here's a zoom in. You know, close up of it, and you can definitely see 
the cone. Uh, that's crazy. Like I said, it looks like there's energy on two sides on the, on the very top left and also on the bottom of this object. And then over here, this car saw the, the object. There were other cars too, but this car actually pulled into the parking lot where the source was, where he was filming it. But he declined um, to, he didn't want to, you know, be on camera or do an interview or anything like that. So here's the footage again. Definitely good stuff, guys. Uh, you know, uh, share, like, and, uh, you know, don't forget to subscribe. And uh, we will talk to you soon. All right, let's take a look at our clip. Uh, it comes to us from Detroit, Michigan. Uh, obviously at the airport. Oh, what's going on with the lights? That's crazy. Look at this object. Uh, let's take a slow this clip down. Like, take a look at it. Wow. Looks like it's glowing and it's like an orange and a blue light. Some kind of orb or something like that. It's moving really fast. Uh, it's crazy. The guy must be trying to adjust the exposure on this clip. But uh, that's interesting. There's a lot of uh, noise on here in grain. So obviously the camera must, you know, must have been having a lot of problems with that. But let's take a look at this object zoomed in. Yeah, that's interesting. It's just like a light that zoomed by there very interesting good footage I mean it's not the clearest of footage but you can definitely see the object and it is pulsating so guys don't forget to share like and subscribe we'll be bringing you these videos as soon as we get it and we'll talk to you soon all right let's take a look at this footage it comes to us uh, July 2016 we do not know the exact location Man, look at this thing. Uh, kind of looks like it might be a little bit translucent. But, uh, judging by the size, it's most probably a little bit smaller than uh, a car. But, uh, it's kind of hard to tell. We don't know how high up off the ground this particular image is. There were multiple witnesses that did see this sighting. Um, this is crazy. Uh, the source actually pulled off the side of the road and was taking this uh, footage according to his testimony. Look at that. Here's a zoom in close up of the object. No idea what that is. Apparently it made no noise whatsoever. Oh man, that is uh, crazy. But, uh, you know, could it be a drone? Sure. Um, but still no idea. Guys, don't forget to share, like. And you know, if you're not already subscribed, subscribe to the channel. We'll be posting stuff as soon as we get it, and we'll talk to you soon. Alright, let's take a look at our clip here. It is going to come to us from Wisconsin. And uh, looks like some kind of junkyard or wreck yard. Looks like a bunch of pallets and stuff in the background. Take a look at this object. Wow, that's interesting. It's uh, almost like a ball with like a disc around it. Seems kind of translucent. But uh, it did make a little buzzing noise according to the source. But it did not come through on the video footage. We even tried to raise the sound on it but we could not hear it so uh, you know unfortunately that piece of the evidence is missing let's take an extreme close-up of this as you can tell wow it's crazy so it does look almost like a planet or something like that but uh, definitely not that size but anyway so this is the footage guys uh, we're gonna have to say proof positive on this just wish the sound had come through better on it so anyway, don't forget to like, subscribe, and uh, you know, share it, and we'll talk to you soon.